Samuelson to Williams. And a three from the freshman to start the fourth. She's got it. Out to Mabry. Ogumbawale for three. Arike Ogumbawale started to heat it up in the third. She's got 10 of her 12 in the second half. Samuelson steps over against Shepard and drains it. Starts to get going. Into tight quarters, a turnover by Mabry. Williams recoils and scores. Timeout, Muffin McGraw. Largest UConn lead was nine in the first quarter. And they tie that here. Dangerfield to Collier. Young's open, good look, knocks it down. Another outstanding back and forth game between UConn and Notre Dame. Collier the offensive rebound of the stick back. So again, it's the ball screen in the middle of the floor. Ogumbawale got free, 4-3. Her second of the quarter. Ogumbawale to tie the game. Rebound Turner, out to Mabry. And we're squared up at 66. Notre Dame comes back, looking for the lead. Ogumbawale. Shepard got it back to her. And Enrique puts Notre Dame in front. Walker beats Shepard to the rim and scores. Here's Turner. Down to Shepard, what a pass for the lead. Walker off the inbound, knocks it down. The sophomore delivers the lead back to UConn. Samuelson against Shepard somehow got it to go. Much more difficult layup that time than the look right down the end. Ogumbawale knocks it down. Notre Dame retakes the lead. A spot in the championship on the line. Shepard gives Notre Dame the lead. UConn down by three with the ball. Williams over to Collier. Blocked by Turner. Final seconds. The Irish put down the Huskies for a second straight year, and they're headed back to the championship game to defend their title. Brianna Turner, last year you had to sit and watch from the bench with a torn ACL. So what was your mindset when you got to take the floor for your team tonight? My only mindset was that UConn season was going to end tonight, no matter what it took. If I was going to rebound, scoring, boxing out, playing hard D, we were going to get the win. With about a minute left in this game, you guys were only up by one, and you had a block that broke the school record. Of all the blocks you've had, why was that one so emphatic? It was such a tight game. UConn's such a great program. They, they know how to close out tight games. So we had to get a stop, and they had to foul us, so I had to be up hard. You just told me, I'm so tired. <laughs> Is this one of those games where you had to leave everything out on the floor? No doubt. I mean, I have one game left in my college career, so like this is it. So I don't have to leave it all out on the court. You'll now have a day to regroup and play against two big time players, Blani Brown and Lauren Cox in the post. How will you find more gas in your tank? Oh, I'm gonna be ready. I'm gonna be ready. Get a nice sleep tonight. We have our sisters are gonna give us a great scout, so we'll be ready to go Sunday. Thank you, Bree. Thank you.